All right, let's see if the world stops putting me in uh, Silent Hill territory. I guess one thing I could do. Why don't I try? Let's try launching an offline mode. Maybe that'll solve my problem. Yeah, try not to run so fast. We'll see. That's Henry VIII. Sorry. Okay, so yeah. Hopefully by being offline we can pause. And hopefully this also means it won't glitch out. And then make it so I can't uh, progress. Is Wanda already cheesing the game? Kind of depends on what you mean by cheesing. My strats are definitely kind of cheesy. Seeks to summon armies of the undead using a power that rests deep within an ancient and forgotten desert temple. Finding the temple, however, is an adventure in its own right, for the entrance lies hidden somewhere in this canyon, a sprawling maze of malevolent mobs and lost secrets. But yeah, let's let's see how this goes. Worst comes to worst, if it continues to silent heal me, we just uh, maybe go back to the dungeon. To one of the levels that doesn't glitch out. Looks like a Dragon Quest builder's area. Oh, right. I'm, I'm supposed to use my crossbow. Because, yeah, my crossbow is 100% the, uh, the champion here. Because, yeah, freaking just set everything on fire, not even care. Whoops. Wait that for a second. Where's the... Where's this dude? Please stop doing that. These pillars are great. I'd love it if they actually... Oh, there he is. He is gone. Ow. But, like, I, I really do hope they port all of these units over into regular Minecraft. Because some of them are just kind of really cool. Hi, I'm new. I saw your channel when I searched Minecraft Dungeons. Yeah, welcome! I, I'm i actually kind of surprised how well I ranked in terms of uh, search results on, the, on this game. I guess I'm just kind of one of the first people to play it for whatever reason. Uh, but like, I am very much not a channel that is based normally around Minecraft. Uh, in fact, I pretty much had never even uh, streamed it up until a couple months ago. At which point I decided like, hey, let's do a uh, Skyblock run. Which was really fun. And then uh, now I've just been... Well, I'm actually... I'm super down for Minecraft Dungeons. This is more my speed than anything else. And so it's kind of fun to dive in. I'm only going to be able to play for a little bit. But I'm trying to conserve most of my enthusiasm for Tuesday. Because I'm going to want to stream more of it, like, probably tomorrow night and, and Tuesday, give or take. I'm just going to wait for that one. Let's see. Bang. I really like the flaming arrows. They are kind of nuts. The burning damage isn't quite as good as I was hoping it would be. Holy crap, there's a lot of these guys. Were there this many the last time I did this? I don't know, but I like it. These deceased. I'm hoping I could get up high here. How am I doing on ammunition? I'm doing okay. Yeah, what I really want is, like, better ricochet or the bonus shot. I like a more regular bow, maybe? I like the shotgun bow, though. It's solid. Maybe I'd want, like, faster attack speed or who knows what. Definitely some proper hunter armor. Maybe. I guess the one problem is the proper hunter armor gets, uh, does not... It gets me the bonus arrows, but it doesn't actually give me the cooldown on the flame arrows that I'm looking for. Which is a bit of a trade-off. But then again, what I really want are wolves. 
I want my dog, boys. I want my creeper bait. Get out of here, creeper. There we go. Ow. Right, we get... That's eh, a heavy crossbow. Whenever I see one of those big chests, I... I always wish there was some kind of, like, rule. That, like, you have to... Well, you don't have to, but... Like, I kind of wish games had better loot distribution, so you're just always getting, like, the really cool things. Trash loot always just kind of makes me sad. Like, I would rather just get occasional money drops or something. And no white items, if that makes sense. Like, what's a good example? I don't know. I just don't really like trash loot. Any Anything that qualifies as vendor trash for me is just kind of like, what, why even make it drop? What is the point of this thing? Alright, it hasn't busted on me so far. This is usually where this mission breaks. Ah, that's a little farther than last time. Yeah, there was an online glitch or it was something the last time I played. And I am entirely unsure. Bye. Nope. Oh wait, no, no, no. No, we haven't we haven't been this far yet. Uh let's see, what is over here? The side path. That's for sure. Is there anything useful here? Should probably also turn up the music. It's very quiet. That's actually, like, pretty good. So I'll do that, at least for now. What does the wizard robes do? Uh, increases my HP. Gives me, uh, reduced cooldowns. So specifically, I'm able to use my fire arrows a lot more often than I normally would be able to do. Let's see. And yeah, last time I came down the center and got mobbed by everybody. This is working out a little bit better. Okay. Grab you. I guess I don't actually have to be in the same general range. Where are all of the enemies? Last time there was felt like a ton more. Also emeralds. My cash money. Get out of here. <laughs> I do like I do like the uh the shot crossbow. It's just like, hey, group of enemies, not anymore. It feels very validating. Uh, oh. Ow. <laughs> My strategy was to shoot the, the pig. And not the creeper. Oh. Oh well. Personally, I'm playing with the idea of all items having a use, even if it's construction materials. I think that's fine. Okay. Let's see. Next stage. So far, so good. Burn for me, piggy. Alright, we get another trick bow. If, if I could get a trick bow with swiftness, I think I'd actually roll it. Because I, I could see that being worthwhile. There's multi-shot and bonus shot. Yeah, because what I want from the trick trick bow is for the arrows to actually fly at regular bow speed. Because currently they're kind of bad. Like, probably works in, like, melee-ish combat, where you're just, like, blasting groups. But if I can run nearly as fast as arrows, something is wrong. 
How's the loot variety? Better than Minecraft. Uh, I, you know, honestly, I'm going to say this, and this is going to be controversial. I think the loot variety is actually, whoa. I think the loot variety is actually just straight up better than uh, Diablo. Because unlike in Diablo, where the item effects are really useful and important, uh, in this one, the straight item is actually, like, rather impactful on your gameplay. You know, I'm... I really do care about what weapon I am using. And not just for the attack speed, but, like, how fast do the projectiles fly? Is it a spread pattern? Is it... Uh, does it have bounce arrows and so on and so forth? Like, there, there is something about that that I feel like, uh, a lot of Diablo likes kind of lose, and a lot of games lose. Uh, the closest I could compare it to is, like, you know, when you're playing Halo or uh, FPS, you have a preference for what kind of gun you're using. You're not just going to pick up a gun and be like, yep, this is a gun like the other guns. Unless you've been playing too much of it, and then it starts to feel like that. Um, and I'm not necessarily saying that this specifically has enough variety to really... Match up, but like double dagger really matters versus glaive because your reach really like makes a difference. Is that it? That was easy. Hey, thank you, Drunken Legends, for the 15 month resub. Thank you. Okay, there we go. I'll go back for the other guys. I just don't want to carry around with the... With the key on my back. Not that it seems to matter. It seems like most of the enemies just uh, take the key for themselves. And then that's about it. We. Even unlock diamond sword. I have no idea what that means here. Oh, that's that's where the key went. Come back here. You do not get to escape. This is the no escape territory. He really does not want to be. Uh, he really does not want to be used. I guess it makes sense. It's effectively death for him. Wow. A lot of these guys spawned in here. I like it how I didn't kill these guys specifically because, you know, I had a key on my back. And then I come back when I have the other key on my back for some reason. Okay, by the way, um, can you guys bother me in just shy of an hour? Make sure I don't play longer than that. Because Good Shepherd wants me at 7. And I do not want to be late, because I am a good boy. And I also don't want to overplay this too much. Because that can come later when we're closer to release, probably. I mean, realistically, it seems like it's better now. And and do not not tell me. Uh, because you want me to play more Minecraft. Because that's actually super bad, and I shouldn't do that. But I'm currently not, in, uh, not within sight of a clock.
Okay. Oops. Got that. At least we're getting plenty of areas, so we don't have to worry too much. Let's maybe go that way, but let's go over here for a bit. Let's see, so there's no way for you, you normies to play? Yeah, sorry. It'll it'll be out in two days, so you do not have to wait too long. Plus, it seems like they've got a couple of uh, little bugs here and there. Might be uh, might be best to wait for them to get patched out anyway. Ah, oh, that's a lot of creepers. Maybe if this bow were to have. Poison clouds, I go for it. How about though it actually was an option for this and I just totally disregarded? Okay, grab that. I don't think we actually needed that as much. So, moment of truth. Let's see if this crashes or not. It's possible that just any non beta levels have this bug. Hopefully, they're fixed though. That's not promising. Nope, that is promising. All right, we're good. Cause yeah, what's supposed what was supposed to happen the last time I came through here is that the gate was supposed to go up, but it did not, and I was confused and a little upset. But now I think we're I think we're good to go. Is that it? Is there anybody left? Nope. Boop. I sounded a hell of a lot like Banjo there. It's kinda perfect. Alright. Now we can go into the temple. I was worried about this. Boop. I was found that was just it. Desert temple. Who knows what truths and treasures await you inside? I only found half the chests. I just have some trouble carrying. It's more important for me to finish the uh, objectives. We'll find them later. I do not have enough emeralds. Oh, probably because I need to actually deal with these. Level 20 trick boat. It's not actually better than what I have. Someone gets... Oh, it's attack speed. Oh, shot speed isn't a thing. Alright. Get rid of all of these. Uh, so do I want gear or do I want new abilities? I want new abilities. That actually seems really worthwhile. I'm gonna get it in, instead of my speed boost, at least for now. So, that's the debt. I got it. Alright, let's do the redstone mines. Seeing as we're here. Do you get encumbered for holding lots of items? Nope. Not the slightest. There are unsettling rumblings in the mountains of the overworld. Whispered rumors say the Illagers are building something dreadful far beneath these ancient mines. Something of soot, metal, and flame. Only a hero such as yourself could brave the cavernous underground and uncover the truth. Okay, I'm going the right way. There's just no monsters yet. Bam! Okay, yeah, that's worth it. There's a mild temptation to just stack a bunch of fireworks arrows and just go bananas with those. That might honestly be better. Oh, it's a monster spawner. That's fun. Now, I could sit here and farm. 
I don't think that's really worth worth my time. So we're just gonna we're just gonna wipe that well wipe everything out. It's crossbow though. Ow. Ow. That is not actually small damage. Okay, avoid that. Let's turn the map off for a second. There they go. Bang! Yeah, I don't quite have enough. Ow. I don't have quite enough... arrows to squander like this. I didn't get it. Yeah, hopefully we can get some more arrows here. But I think, I think this is as good of a, uh, a, a good of a reason as any to actually start investing in increasing my overall like ammo gain and reducing my my costs. Let's see, we get Splunker armor, eh, which comes with the pet. If the Splunker armor worked. We? Nope, that doesn't work. I was curious if there's something down there. That that hole looked way too intentional to not be something, and it was nothing. It was actually just nothing. It's fine. Okay. Eesh, these guys, these guys got, got tough. Oop. There we go. Yeah, I'm aware I'm low on arrows. You're not really supposed to do archery unless you're, uh... Let's see, you're not really supposed to do archery unless you're rolling hunter. Well, no, you can do archery whenever you want. Ow. that over there. Hopefully that gets a number of them. Uh, yeah, it's a lot harder to keep up with, like, pure archery if you don't have the hunter set. And I am not. Get you out of here. Now, can I... Oh, I can actually free these guys. Hey. So I'm actually supposed to rescue them. I thought I was just going to ignore them like a jerk. Not get run over because that would be embarrassing. See, how's the magic system? Don't think you've seen it yet. Uh, you have actually kind of, sort of. Uh, if you notice, I have flaming arrows. That is the magic system. Whoa! Whoa! Okay. Underestimated just how aggressive those slime bits were. Uh, let's see. But so the magic system is effectively you get three abilities of any variety. I haven't really found a many that are pure magic. Admittedly. Most of them are more archery related or so on and so forth. Grab those. Uh, but I, I know there's I know there's a lot more abilities than I've found so far. I just have to find them. And that that really does kind of backfire on you. There we go. Uh, let's see. But currently, I'm still wearing the mag the magic outfit. Wow, that kind of works. Uh, I'm still wearing the magic outfit because it gets me better cooldowns, which is actually really nice. So interesting other factoid 
I was really hoping the, uh... I was really hoping the fireworks would actually... I do that. Does it pause? It does. Okay, here we go. I was hoping the fireworks with the shot bow would actually mean I could just fire uh, five explosive arrows. No, it only synergizes with the uh, the bonus arrow and not with the the main arrow. So the more you progress through the game, the more you use your bow. Yeah, I think melee is perfectly viable. It's just from my perspective, I like using my bow. Because my bow is incredibly good at clearing groups of enemies. Uh, which is a little harder in melee. I'm also not the most durable fellow. Now if I had a glaive, I think I'd use melee a little bit more. I don't know. Once, once I have a better supply of abilities that I can toy with, I think it'll be easier. But currently, uh, I've only found mostly trash tier, trash tier pickups. There we go. Yeah, this is probably where the trick bow would shine. If I put myself in this corner, I either die or I slay everything like a hero. Okay, bit of both. I got surrounded. Nope. That's an act. That's an answer, though. Yeah, I like the firework arrow. It is. Whoop. It is effective. Like, always. Okay. I'm not gonna get surrounded, so if I just sit here and just blender man... I do enough- I think I do enough damage that I can just kill them all. Ow. Well... That kind of... dissuades me. Ow. Okay, so I can... I can get hit. This game does not pause when you're in a menu. Okay, chains or thundering? Let's go thundering. Okay, thundering is amazing on this. Hell yeah. Okay, I don't have any better armor though. Well, we could go for the Splunker armor. Cowardice. Increased melee and range damage at full HP. Not the most useful, seeing as I'm on my own. I can see that being real good. In, like, multiplayer or something. Let's go full coward. Coward's build. Would be a bad move. Oh, I don't see anything back here. Onwards we go. Worked great with the hammer. I haven't actually... I don't think I've found the hammer yet. I don't know. I think this works best with the... Uh, I think this works best with the daggers. <laughs> Maybe I'm wrong on that one, but I'm I'm getting the proc a lot more often just because I attack so fast. Ow. Is 
deserve that damage. Get out of here, Zambonis. Alright. The unfortunate part is I ate, ate a corn dog before I started recording this. I'm still freaking hungry. In fact, I'm hungrier now. Alright, so we've got an evoker. Okay. So the evoker himself is not actually that threatening. It's just that you get overwhelmed trying to deal with him. But these daggers should be able to mess him up pretty quick, especially because his stupid fairies are not a problem. We're getting non-stop Splunker armor. Have fun back there, jerks. We. I like the idea of the Shadow Brew. Not terribly hel helpful in this one. Hello, yes. Is there anything down here, or are you guys just living in a nook? They're living in a nook. Is the boss music loud as F? F. Yup. Yeah, it's pretty loud. I think, um... So I turned up the music so I could hear everything better. Uh, because the actual soundtrack for this game is quite quiet. Problem is, uh, that means when the music does pick up, it actually is pretty loud. Oh, so they do get killed by the cart. Okay. possible time. It's fine. It's fine. I can resist the, uh, the siren call of the comfort Oreo. I have a whole package next to me and I'm kind of hungry. I keep shooting them. Why are they considered targets? What kind of maniac am I? See, if you get enemies in front of the cart, will it damage them? It straight up kills them. Wow. What am I hitting? I think I, it must have been aiming at the, uh... It must have been aiming at the this guy. Ow. Oh, that could have killed me again. I gotta be wary of those carts. Oh, good. Get out of here, spawners. I could fight you. That would ruin the fun. Okay. Let's see. I think both of these daggers are virtually identical. It's good. Oh, that only... That just increases the damage. It's probably still worth it. 17 damage, chain lightning is real good. I was hoping I could increase the, uh... The occurrence rating. Because if I could get it to proc more than 30% of the time... Nothing would ever get close to me in melee, except for the really big guys. Those are still dangerous. Come on. Maybe I need that mushroom back. I do kind of need that mushroom back. Okay, well, I've got plenty of ammo now. So I don't have much to worry about. Right, grab that. Gr 
grab that. Goodbye. Oh. Wow. Didn't actually finish the spawner off. I'm impressed. I'm digging these daggers. I I originally kind of poo-pooed them. I was like, ah, it's not worth it. Oh. Don't step on the lava. Makes sense. Well, this guy is considerably easier. He is considerably easier than the last boss I had to fight. He had a shadow brew on him. That's not the most helpful. Let's see. The other dagger has more enchantments on it. Doesn't matter. Also, no. No, it doesn't. Okay, anything else? Nope, we're done. Eh. Hey. The rumors are true. The Illagers are building a dreadful forge under the mountain. First, or here, before we progress further, for I am getting hungry. I'm probably going to just keep getting Torment Quiver. Ooh. I'm probably going to keep going for abilities. What is this? Slow arrows that knock back... Knocks back... back Ooh. Okay. It requires souls, but that...